Hello and welcome back to the channel. Today I thought it would be fun to share with you my recent Dollar Tree haul. I found a lot of great items that I think would make great stocking stuffers. Let's get started. The first item I want to share with you is this adorable Peanuts Gang stocking. I am hoping to get a video up on blessing stockings that I plan to do, but that is what this is going to be used for. The next item is this really fun craze maze activity book. And Dollar Tree actually gets these throughout the year. Whenever I find them, I grab them. My son loves them, <laughs> and this is gonna be a great stocking stuffer for him. It's got easy levels, then it's got medium, and then of course, hard. These are so cool, and I have a couple of them, so bear with me here. <laughs> Um, this is the first time I've seen this. Um, it's a Crayola activity pack, 30 coloring pages and four crayons, and they're the twistable crayons. Those twistables are pretty heavy duty. We've used them before. But this is great for stocking up on for birthdays, stockings, Christmas gifts, Easter baskets. So whenever you see those, you might want to grab a few. They don't last very long. And here is another one. This one is Cosmic Cats. Look at how adorable. Such a good deal for a dollar twenty-five. And then I found this really cool Maze Mania Hot Wheels. Uh book that's got mazes in it and a little like game to play on the front. I'm not good at this game. Can't even get it in. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> so um, there's that. And this is going to be a stocking stuffer. Um, my son loves mazes and he loves Hot Wheels. And here is, whoops, what one of the inside pages looks like. They're always so hard for me to find, um, but they, they've got uh, multiple styles of these. Unfortunately, I don't remember the other ones. I just remember grabbing the Hot Wheels because <laughs> that's what's big in our house. <laughs> and then um, I found these really cute um, coloring and activity books. Uh, they make great stocking stuffers. The first page has stickers. And this one is critter themed, so it's got animals. And it's got games. And coloring pages. And it's just really pretty. And then there's one, Merry Mermaids. Let's see the front. And then, look at how cute, <laughs> those fish singing. Great for gift giving. And then I also like to stock up on Christmas bags. These little tiny ones, they come in a pack of three. They're all the same. Um, it's okay, I don't mind though, because I love barn themed Christmas. So that's what these are. They're themed for barns and there's three of them and they're great for like, they're really small. So they're good for putting like gift cards in, maybe candies, maybe something small like socks or something. And then I bought another pack of three, a little more. This has glitter on it. So glitzy snowflakes. And this is great for even if you're going to put a gift in January. <laughs> So these don't say Merry Christmas, so they can be used a little longer. And then the next item that I have, these are great. This is the first time I've seen these. Um, they are beach balls. 
that's got Cookie Monster and that's got Elmo. And these are really great for Operation Christmas Child boxes. Um, I know at our church, we try to include a ball in each box for each child as it's great hand-eye coordination for them. And these are great because as a beach ball, they lay flat. So there's the back of that. And the back of that one. And I was able to grab Cookie Monster and Elmo. I think they had Oscar too. I'm not sure. I can't remember. Um, this guy is so cute. It's a moose or a reindeer, I think. One or the other. Um, he's just really big compared to some of the stuffed animals that Dollar Tree has. So... I bought a couple of these and I kind of spruced him up and here's what the spruced up one looks like. I took the scarf off and I put a bow on him and the gingham ribbon came from Dollar Tree also, but he's so cute. Great for gift giving. And then Dollar Tree has carried these before. Look at how cute these babies are. They used to be bigger. But um, this is good, though. This size is still good. It's great for, like, putting in uh, Operation Christmas Child boxes. They make great stocking stuffers. Here, for comparison, I'll put the moose right by it. See how big the moose is and how the dolls are kind of a little smaller? But they're so cute. And, like, the head of the doll is heavy duty. It's really, really hard to squeeze. So the plastic on the head is just made really well. Here's the back of it. And back of this one, so cute. And then I also picked up one of these cute mugs. Sorry, it's a little blurry there. I'm trying to get it in focus. Um, these are great for like putting hot cocoa in, coffee in, gift giving. Um, great for filling with chocolates and a gift card maybe. He's so cute though. And he can stay out for, like, January and February, too. Because <laughs> snowmen can do that. <laughs> um, we always try to keep a box of this in our house for, like, movie night and whatnot. Um, it comes in a pack of three. And they are individual size, so they're not humongous size bags. But um, the ingredients seem to be pretty good non-gmo so not bad for microwavable and then i recently found these for the first time they are so cool and they're going to be a stocking stuffer for my kids care us first aid 21 count a uh, pack of medical supplies Oops. And this one has little germs on it. And look at this cute one with puppies. And they're metal. <laughs> so heavy duty. And then I've seen these at Dollar Tree before. Haven't seen them in a while, so I was thrilled to find them today. Air pumps. Excellent for putting in Operation Christmas child boxes, um, especially obviously for a boy if you're going to pack a soccer, soccer ball in there. Um, they need a pump to go with it. It's got the hose and the, the needle. Um, so I grabbed a couple of those for next year's boxes. These are probably my favorite from the haul. <laughs> they're going to be stocking stuffers. Um, they're these silly socks. And Dollar Tree gets them in time to time. They're great to stock up on when you do see them. They go quickly. And they're great for Easter. They're great for stockings. They're great for gift giving. Um, but my son, he's going to get these in his stocking. He loves Ritz crackers and corn pops. Those are just really cool. And then we have these, we have a couple of these fun projectors in our, our house. Um, my son particularly loves them. Um, 
This one is an LED disco light. He's also got a Halloween one and a Christmas one. And it takes a couple batteries. And I'm not sure. Let me see. How many batteries does this take? Use and care. I'm sure it's on there somewhere. <laughs> Anyways, um, this one is disco, and when you turn the turn the bottom on, the bottom switch on, and you set it on a table or whatnot, um, it lights up the ceiling with all kinds of cool designs. I know the Christmas one does like trees, presents, snowmen, um, and then the Halloween does like uh, spooky pumpkins, ghosts, and whatnot, but this one was really neat. This is the first time I've seen that one, so he's going to really like that one. And then, um, this is going in my daughter's, daughter's stocking. It's a USB mini vacuum cleaner. Takes the USB cable, no batteries needed, and it'll be interesting to see how this works but I know she is going to enjoy that. And then, whoops, for, I, ha I got these stored away. We're gonna store them away for New Year's. This is the first time I've seen them. Um, they're those party poppers. This is the first time I've seen them in the shape of like a little champagne bottle. Look at how cute. So they have the regular cylinder ones that you pop and a bunch of like pretty, Foilage comes out of it, streamers and stuff. Um, but this is the first time I've seen them in this shape for New Year's, and they're so cute. They also had them in silver and gold. My kids will be thrilled to see these. And then this is a 10 pack of gel pens. Not bad for a dollar. Here's all the pretty colors it comes with. Great stocking stuffer. Great for putting with maybe the maze book or the Crayola packs. Um, I also, whenever I see these, I try to grab a pack of them. I don't see them very often, but um, they're great for putting in Operation Christmas Child boxes for the girls. And you can fill eight boxes with them. So, um, like I said, you don't find them very often. So, what I do, I try to grab a couple. Here's another pack of the gel pens. They're not many, they're larger, and this is an eight pack. I just think they're great and fun for gift giving. And then these are the Forever Friends dolls that I buy to put in as a wow gift for Operation Christmas Child. Um, I put them in the Forever Friends um, dresser boxes, those purple things um, that I fill with uh, all kinds of fun items for girls, fun fillers. <laughs> um, but they come with four different dolls. I only bought one this time. I just wanted to show you what they look like, and I'm going to be planning to put together a filler box soon again. And then this is a handheld bag sealer. Um, it's got a little magnetic strip on the back so that it can attach to the fridge when you're not using it. It takes a couple batteries and it's basically great for resealing like chip bags and stuff. So I haven't seen this before, but I've seen other people get them and I finally got my hands on one. So it'll be interesting to see how it works. <laughs> Stay tuned. Um, I also got Sesame Street figurines. I only got one this time, but I've gotten the whole collection. They made them a little smaller this time, but they're great fillers for Operation Christmas Child. Um, I got Big Bird today, and they've got Oscar, Elmo, Cookie Monster, and Abby Cadabby. Some prayer cards. They're great for gift giving. And great for memorizing scripture. This pack is so pretty. I love the flowers on it. And finally, I have this obsession with pens lately. 
my kids like them but um these fun uh scented gel pens great stocking stuffers really cute and go well with coloring books again mazes maybe a journal but so cute and i'm just going to show you everything again and hopefully this gives you some great ideas for stocking stuffers. I know I got a lot of stuff here. <laughs> gotta move things around a little. I hope this gave you some great ideas. And I thank you for watching and I'm hoping to get a few more videos up soon. Have a great day.